Struck on the pad first ball. Big shout from Aussie Kim Garth. Beautiful shot through the covers. What a great way to open the accounts. And that's hit beautifully through cover as well. Slightly over pitched. Wilson all over it, and that's four. Rope is in a fair way here. The late cut, beautiful shot. Plenty of work to do down the boundary. Won't get there. That's four. Faces Sutherland drives through the gap between gully and point, and it'll race away to the boundary rope for four. Wilson this time drives beautifully through the covers. That'll be four. The coach of Australia now. Yeah. Pulled away, short ball, behind square, should go to the boundary. Good shot, Talia Wilson. She moves to 21. <laughs> 300 plus. Oh, lovely shot. Wilson will get back-to-back -back boundaries with a deft leg glance. Just doing it because that's what you do in the warmer. Wilson this time drives firmly. Oh, they find a gap between point Four and more. gully, and this will be the third boundary. And Nick through that vacant area. And that's oh. the problem when you go on a scattergun approach. And that's shorter again. Litchfield this time hits it a little bit squarer and to the boundary for four. Ooh, attempted sweep shot. And that will be out. The first wicket falls. Wilson goes. Wareham gets the first wicket for her return. Over. Left-handed Litchfield on strike. Again, makes a full toss of it with beautiful footwork. And it crashes into the boundary rope. But to get one back against the old nemesis. Down the ground. That's beautifully played. One bounce over the rope. That is the perfect cricket shot. Can we see? That's a beautiful shot. That's four. That's a beautiful shot as well. That's going to get through for four more. Phoebe Litchfield goes bang. And what a way to bring up your 50. Anyway, they're probably not the right people to ask. That's a great shot. Just stand there and smash it for four. Annabelle Sutherland bowls to Annika Leroy. Outside edge, through to the keeper. Fulton takes the catch. Do your heading. Perry bowls again. This time gets the short ball. Pulls it away between the gap between oh, fine leg and square leg. And picks up a boundary. And you're dead right, Bryce. Because That was a good shot. Litchfield on strike to a Perry. Pulled away in front of mid-wicket. That'll go to the boundary rope for four runs. Down league side, a little lap sweep. Beautifully played from Burns. That's going to be four runs. It races away across the junction oval surface. <laughs> it's just another one. And that's going to race away to the deep third boundary. Tell you what, these are the days. If you don't make the most of these days, you never, ever will. That's in the air, and that's over backward point. It's going to be a huge chase, and I don't reckon it's going to get there. It's four. Struck it well. And gone! Wareham strikes, so it doesn't end up costing Victoria too much. Wareham tosses up, driven nicely by Luff. Came down the pitch, second bounce over the rope. Wareham tosses up. Driven magnificently on the offside. Lanning couldn't stop it. Wow. I had a look at the guide last night, and it's in there for next Saturday. Oh, here's a chance. Caught behind. Luff has gone. Sophie Day came back on. Hawley back on strike. It's a fuller ball. Beaten outside the off stump. Took the edge. Fulton gets another catch. Sutherland gets her second wicket. 48 on Thursday. Burns, pulled away beautifully. Four runs. Majestic shot through mid-wicket. Been probably just a few too many of. This is better. That's beautifully played down the ground. Four runs. Slow ball, and that's oh, smashed. No. And smash for four. The worst thing that can happen after a dropped chance. More catching practice required. And that's gone. How? That's the most bizarre dismissal you'll see in a while. We haven't been able to describe most of the drop catches, and it's going to be difficult to describe. A couple of others as they restrict. You say, wow, that's in the air. Now that should also be taken. And this time it is.
Not necessarily all that convincingly. Day, a little bit quicker. Now Sammy Joe goes long, very long indeed. Clears the boundary rope over deep mid-off and makes its way towards Fitzroy Street. Smith on strike and hammers it through the offside. Lauren Smith. Garth to Johnson. Whack. That has gone long, high, almost over the fence. Garth bowls. Johnson goes whack. That's into the stand almost. Over the fence. Three balls to go. Johnson on strike. Winds up again. That one's over the fence as well. Into the lawn in front of the Blackie Ironmonger stand. Three sixes already in the over. Sammy Joe Johnson on strike and goes whack. Hits it down the ground. O'Donnell comes in. Fields. Lauren Smith is honing back in. Garth misses the ball. And they get back for two runs. Johnson finishes 41 not out. And it'll be Lauren Cheadle's stuff for the Fitzroy Street end. Gets that shape that we saw early on from both Garth. Beautifully struck through cover. Four runs. It's another beautiful cover drive from Reed. Good shot. Really good shot. Sophie Reed, this is very good to watch. That's full. It's in the air, but in the gap. And racing out to the point boundary. It's going to be a chase for three fielders and none can get there. Yeah. <laughs> Darlington Bowles and Reed again is putting on a master class of the cover drive and the off drive. Sophie Reed is going. Another full ball and another drive to the boundary for four by Sophie Reed. This is quality batting. Darlington again, short, pulled away this time through the onside for four. What about this? This is great batting. Sophie Reed. Oh, oh, goodness me. Boundary number seven. Smith again. Tour tossed up. This time that'll be hammered away by Reed. A second bounce over the rope. That's a good job. Oh, yeah. The scoreboard operator. Going tight now. There's that leading edge. High in the air. This is a big moment in the game. Oh, good catch. Aaron Burns takes a beauty. Sun in the eyes, it was spinning around like a top. Dive full stretch. Tanner Darlington. And Lanning, oh, lovely shot. Gets one on leg stump, clips it away, down to the boundary for four runs. Right, here we go. Hannah Darlington on leg stump, beautiful shot. Whipped away by Perry, down to the boundary for four more. The slip stays in. Darlington, oh, driven straight back down the ground. By Elise Perry. Pretty close up there at first slip. Perry gets a loose ball, short ball. And Ebony Hoskin misses that one. And it's going to cost the boundary. There's Lauren Smith, tossed up. Perry goes, whack. Hits it hard, hits it high. That is over the rope for six. You know it's the time of the game. Perry and Lanning together. That one smashed through mid on. Just a little bit short. It's set up to be hits. At least Perry does not miss out on those. Put down a chance or two. And now that goes even further. And that's six runs. Advances and then smashes it through mid-wicket for four. The City Power Centre crowd are very much enjoying this. Oh, good shot. Stop. It's a really good shot. It's going to go for four, not surprisingly. Just the sound off the bat was fantastic. Beautiful shot down the ground. Can it beat mid off? Four. Slight misfield. In fact, kicked it even harder. And it's going to go for four. That's when you know it's your day. Shows you how many runs they need. That's a beautiful shot. <laughs> that is such a good cricket shot. Felt that she missed out on Thursday. She doesn't often miss out Hit twice. That better. That is smashed into the concrete underneath the fence and come back about six metres. Great value. Johnson bowls. Oh, dear me. Straight back over the head. Goes Lanning with a magnificent shot. Now she's just opening up her game. Johnson again and Lanning again. Goes longer this time, but not quite over the rope. 
Here's Johnson. Short Lanning. Pulled it away between fine leg and square leg for another boundary. Johnson. Bowls again to Lanning. And she hits it straight back to, down the ground. First bounce over the rope. And Lanning brings up her 37.50 in A-list cricket. What a great return. Meg Lanning in sparkling touch with her ninth boundary. Johnson again. Short. Pulled away. This is going to go to the boundary as well. Four more. Feasting out at the junction oval. Johnson bowls again. Full toss. Lanning smacks it. That is four boundaries in a row to Meg Lanning. She moves to 59. She dominated that opening partnership. That one's full. That one's hit away. A chance for a catch. Gone. Excellent catch. Out in the deep. Taken by Aaron Burns. And if it was going to go to a player and you wanted to be caught, it would have to be. It's well played through mid-wicket. That's a beautiful shot from Sutherland. Have a look at the timing. And that's back with a point. Slash beautifully for four. You just can't keep bowling dots. There's no way and it works with Elise Perry. We're in the 24th over. Well, we can add another one. That's just been beautifully timed over midweek, and that's 50 for Elise Perry. It's a high five from her mate. Get games under her belt. She goes again. That one's a bit shorter, and it's knocked away down on the offside. Off the back foot, through the offside. And where she has to bowl that ball. Oh, that's a deft touch from Perry. Beautifully played. There was no power, but my goodness, there was quality and touch. It should be massive. Down the wicket comes a very strong shot from Perry over the rope for six. Sloan <laughs> knew, knew it existed as a, a, a role. As Darlington continues from the city end. Um, there weren't as many opportunities for girls to do that when I was growing up. Goes over long off this time. Doesn't matter where you bowl. Somehow she can find the rope. Sutherland's in fantastic form. Moves to 27. Of the current players. That's down league side. It's a poor delivery but well put away. Smash, and that should be caught, and it is. It's a good catch. I think she might have done her ankle as well. Might have just rolled the ankle as took the catch. It was a really good catch. It was hit firmly. Sutherland's gone. There you go. <laughs> this is what we got you in for. Now, is that going to be called a no ball? I think it came down in time. It's been smashed over cover. That's four. And now a lap. Now she's just taking the mickey out of cricket. <laughs> Steps back and now tries to slay it through the offside and picks the gap. And that's going to race away through the boundary for four. And now hits it over backwards square for six. Like two fours weren't enough. You're going to stay on, mate. And uh, we, you're gonna, you can be a special comments guru. Could be a catch. No, dropped. And it rolls down to the boundary for four. And that's Nicole Fulton. Love seeing that from the skipper. Oh, here's a full bunger, and that one is going to go long and high out to the boundary. It sort of plugs like a nine-on, but it does get to the rope. And I got I... laughed at early on. Here comes Perry again over the top. First bounce over the rope. Four more runs. Perry goes to 125. There from and great to have him in. Pete lays up. Here comes Perry again. Sweeps it away over square leg for another boundary. Cheadle bowls and it's driven and there it is. Winning runs. Fulton, the skipper, drives it through the covers. Victoria have run down New South Wales breakers score of seven for 283. That is a record run chase.